Hey everybody, Heather from Hooked on Picking here. I've got three days worth of sales because of 4th of July, I went an extra day. So I've got three days worth of sales. Let's see what I sold. All right, so these are gonna be my sales on Poshmark. I wasn't able to ship on the 4th of July because of the federal holiday, which is why it's three days and not two. So let's just get right into it. This is a baby doll sheer lingerie set, red and gold. I earned $7.05. I'm gonna tell you exactly what, um, what I earned, and that's after fees, after shipping. For example, this sold for 10, but I only get 705. I ended up paying a dollar for that, so I'm gonna take that off. It makes 605. So my profits are actual true profit numbers because I take into consideration what I paid for the item. Then the next things that I sold was a bundle. And so I've got a black who what wear shirt, size medium. Then I've got a um, uh, who what wear size uh, medium yellow shirt. And then I've got a pair of a New Day, really cute kind of ballet flats. I also have more of these, so they're really, really cute. So you can check those out on my store if you're interested. Size eight and a half are those. My earnings were $20. I spent um, five on these, and then I spent a dollar a piece on these. So I'm at $7 total. My earnings were 20, so I take the seven off the 20. So I'm at $13 of profit on that. Then my next item I have is I've got a lot of intimates on my store because of some of the liquidation boxes that I had got. So I've got a women's lace underwear bra exhilaration black. I spent a dollar on that out of a liquidation box. 505 is what I earned. So 405 are my in-pocket profits. I'm going to add everything up at the end for you guys and let you know what my total profit is. Then I've got a women's seamless bodysuit. Color is white, size extra large. My earnings were $12.00. Take my dollar off that I paid for it. I'm at $11 of profit on that one item. And then I've got these cool rain boots. They're size seven waterproof Chel Chelsea, Kelsia. I, I always mispronounce that. Anyway, uh, those I sold, they were really, really good price. I actually spent $7 on those. I bought a whole pallet of them, made $10.20 on this particular one. And so I take my $7 off. I'm at $3. If you want some of those, they're really, really cute and in brand new condition and they come brand new in the box. So it's a great gift item as well. So I said that I earned 10 20 take my seven off, $3, 20 cents of profit on those boots. Then my next item is a pair of cute little turtle, blue turquoise dangle turtle earrings. I sold these twice in this set, so you'll see them again, but they're turtle turquoise bead silver plate dangle ear earrings. Um, I spent a dollar when I um, got acquired those, so $2.05 is what I earned, so I'm at $1.05, so I doubled my money on that one. I'm excited about that. And so I'll get those shipped off right away. Women's Everyday Bra True White Gilligan and O'Malley, size 40D. $7.05 is what I earned. Take my dollar off that I paid for it, $6.05. Then I've got a pair, really nice pair of Gina Vitale men's shoes. These are size 13. They're kind of suede. Um, just so you know, um, I'm going to be putting more men's shoes on my store because I just got a bunch more in. Um, there's some behind me on the table. So um, just be on the lookout for those. Lots of size 12s, lots of size 13s for men's dress shoes. Really, really cool looking ones. Anyway, these are a new tag Gino Vitale size 13 lace up dress shoes. I spent $4 out of a liquidation box for these. $11.05 is what I earned. So the $4 minus the $11.05, $7.00 and five cents. Then I have a set, um, it was a bundle that I made myself of Cat and Jack New with tags, 21 pairs of pierced earrings, $4.25. Probably for all those earrings, it was about a buck. And so $3.25 is what I had. Um, those came in a liquidation box with a bunch of other stuff. So I probably only have a dollar invested in those. Then I've got a women's everyday bra, Gilligan and O'Malley, Violet, size 34A, 405 is what I earned. Um, a dollar's what I paid, so two dollars, wait. Can you write that at the next line? Sure, 405 is what I earned, so three dollars and five cents. Yeah, my big bag is kind of in the way here. 
Alrighty, so then I've got my giant bag. Uh, this is actually the last one that I had for sale. And so those have been really good sellers for me. I had four of them. So I spent $2 from a liquidation box. $6.25 is what I earned. So $4.25 are my profits there. And then I've got a St. Louis Cardinals pair of shorts. Really, really nice uh, microfiber shorts. Those I um, got at the Goodwill outlet for Fifty cents, three dollars and twenty-five cents is what I earned, and so I'm at two dollars and seventy-five cents for a profit on those. Then, of course, it's the patriotic holiday, but these were actually ordered around Fourth of July, so I knew these people didn't expect to get them by the fourth. Anything that was ordered before the Fourth of July, I was really good about getting it in the mail quickly so that they could have it by that holiday. And so, ten oh five is what I earned on this bling American flag rhinestone hat. $4 is what I paid, so $6.05 are the profits there. Then I have a women's push-up racerback lace bralette black. Um, I paid a dollar for it, $2.05 is what I earned, so $1.05 are my profits there. Then I sold a tie who's, that's been on my store forever. Timeless Geo Pompeii silk tie made in the USA. 205 is what I earned. That came directly out of my closet, so I get to keep the $2.05. Not out of my closet, out of my husband's closet. <laughs> All right, then I've got a vintage secret treasure size medium PJ top. 205 is what I earned from the Goodwill outlet. I got that for 50 cents. And so I am at $1.55 for my profits on that one. Then I have a really nice one piece swimsuit, black and white V-neck. It's got really cute pink colored details, size extra large, $15 is what I earned on that. I paid $2 for that and so I'm at $13 for my profits on that swimsuit. Then I'm gonna wander back on down to this one here. I've got a nursing unlined bra, Gilligan and O'Malley, size 38 double D. 525 is what I paid a dollar from a liquidation box is what I earned or sorry 525 is what I earned a dollar from a liquidation box is what I paid I flipped those around four dollars and 25 cents then I've got I love when I sell these because I like to show them in the videos a seamless street cookie monster hipster hipster panties and they say nom 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 along the van. I just think they're so cute and adorable. Size mediums. I paid a dollar out of a liquidation box. Two oh five is what I earned. So a dollar five are my profits there. Yeah, I can move that. We'll lay it down here. There. Can you see better? All right. And then I've got another rhinestone hat that I sold. Um, that one I earned ten oh five. Take away the four. I'm at six dollars and five cents on that hat. Then I have another patriotic hat, but it's perfect for guys or gals. It's a patriotic curved gray, small, gray baseball adjustable hat. Um, it's got a nice embroidered USA on the inside of the trucker part. And so I've got various different colors of these. So check out my store. You'll see a bunch of them on there. Um, or you can buy them at hookedonpicking.com. 805 is what I earned. $4 is what I paid. So $4 and five cents. Uh, for that particular hat. And then I've got a seamless Bando Gilligan and O'Malley black bra. It's a size medium. $3.25 is what I earned. A dollar is what I paid. So $2.25 are my profits there. Then I have a, a two pack of seamless briefs underwear. They don't have seams on the side, so that's kind of handy and nice and comfy. They're very soft. $5.05 is what I earned. $1 what I paid, so $4.05. Remember, this is three days worth of sales because of the 4th of July holiday. Then the last thing I have is another pair of those cute turquoise turtle earrings, um, of which I paid $1 for. $3.05 is what I earned on that pair. $2.05 are my profits there. So I'm going to add everything up, tell you how many orders it is, and get right back to you. 
All right, so just remember when selling on Posh, if there's got a federal holiday coming up, you need to be aware of that when you're shipping. So make sure you can get everything shipped out right away before that holiday hits so that it doesn't delay for your customer. But I sold 24 separate orders for a total of $112.20 for three days of sales on Poshmark. So hopefully it's been enlightening to see what exactly I sell and for how much. Remember, these are all earnings numbers, not actual sales numbers, um, but it's a true number of how much I actually get to pocket after everything sells. And remember in the end, Jesus wins. You guys are a true blessing in my life. Thank you so much for helping me put this content out there to everyone. If you'd like to join these great people, please consider supporting me through my Patreon page. Check the link below. Hey, thanks for watching. I hope you learned something. If you'd like to watch more of my videos, just click on them here. And if you'd like to learn more about the reseller world, subscribe to my channel and check out my other videos. Thanks.